capacity of what Bloomberg News. Do you have a breakdown by gender, roughly, of how many women, girls, boys, and men have been processed by DOD? And it begs a lot of questions in terms of separate facilities. And then I have a second question about culturally appropriate food. Are we talking MREs or humanitarian MREs or uh, local kitchens being hired up to cook? Thanks, Tony. Uh, so we're seeing about 50-50, male, female. That, that can change back and forth. We're seeing about 15% uh, with, with children. We're seeing a lot of, uh, of the females who are pregnant. Uh, so I don't have a, a specific detail for what you asked about for the total number with children, male, female, et cetera. But th that gives you an idea. Uh, we're seeing right now 513 children at one location for a total of about 30 percent of that, the, uh, the location. Uh, with regards to your second question, uh, we're, we contract to provide support, of, you know, meals, uh, multiple meals for large windows. So, for example, we'll provide a breakfast meal for a halal for their culturally appropriate for a three-hour window. We'll shut down for a second, and when I say we, it's a, the contract support at each location. Uh, then we'll spin up for a lunch meal, and we'll do the same for the, the dinner. Uh, most locations, I believe, will have or do have a 24-hour grab-and-go culturally uh, uh, for the, uh, the Afghans as well. I hope that answers your food question. Can we go to the phone, Chair? That Laura Seligman Politico.